Laura Madsen, writer and celebrity publicist of theladyinredblog.com. For the latest takes on entertainment, music, food, fashion, and fun, come check me out at theladyinredblog.com. Hi, this is You're listening to the DJ Danny Show. Let me do that one again. DJ Danny Show. I, 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 I know, yeah. Hi, this is Don Lee, and you're listening to the DJ Danny Show. Good evening, everyone. Today is Tuesday, August 25th, 2015. Welcome to the DJ Danny Show on HamiltonRadio.net, stream HR2. I'm your host, DJ Danny. I have my beautiful and amazing co-host, Laura Madsen, and her ador ad adorable daughter, Amanda. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. Hi, Amanda. And I actually, we're going to have a great show tonight because we have Experiment 34 in the house, live, actually. They're live. Hey, how's it going? Hey, guys. And I have my amazing best friend, um, Angelica. Hi. You, you need to come so much. I don't know what to say. It's been a while. Mike. Hi, everyone. <clears throat> Anyways, um, if you guys want to get in touch with Experiment 34, uh, you know who's live in the studio, the number is 609-800-1003. And let's start the show. So, uh, I'm Laura Madsen. I am a writer and publicist of theladyinredblog.com, and I jump in and co-host from time to time. Yes, you do. On shows like this. I'm glad to be back, Danny. And tonight, we have a little veteran sort of kind of <laughs> helper here on radio with me, and this is my daughter, Amanda. Hi, Amanda. And let's go around the table, because we've got Experiment 34 in the house, yes, we and do. Glad they to be are here. one of the up-and-coming New Jersey bands that you guys really need to pay attention to. Um, Love their music. Yeah. <laughs> you guys will get a taste of that later in the show, or in the beginning of the show, we'll see. So we'll start with you, Matt. All right, I'm Matt, I'm the vocalist. Glad to be here, thank you for having me on. No Us problem. Us on, of course. <laughs> uh, I'm Kevin, I'm the lead guitar player, and also I sing. <laughs> I'm Johnny Z, but I play the bass guitar, do a little bit of the slappy slaps, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm also a backup singer. I do not sing because it's hard to do while I'm playing the drums. I'm hey. Jack, by the way. And you play the cajon? <laughs> Acoustically, I play the cajon, yes. <laughs> <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. All right, so when I was first looking up your tracks and everything, um, you know, I was looking at your bio because Laura sent it to me twice, and I wanted to make sure I was coming up with good questions, not, like, just off the bat. You know what I mean? Well, the off the bat questions are good, too. You know, like, you know, what, what kind yeah, of toothpaste yeah. do you brush your teeth with? Like, Well, we don't brush our teeth. Yeah, yeah, none. yeah I was yeah. going to say none. Uh, gin and tea. Yeah, we just... <laughs> <laughs> we chew on leaves and just hope that works. Yeah, mint leaves here and there once a month, but that's for freshness. That's what kinda... made you call your band Experiment 34? Because was it called <laughs> The Strangers at first? We yeah, were The called. Strangers okay. at first. Um, we were told that there already is a The Strangers. Yeah. So like more uh, than this one. Like a million <laughs> and, strangers. Yeah, there's a ton of them, so we kind of wanted to stand out. Um, you know, we, we were bouncing a lot of ideas mm -hmm. uh, around, and uh, we're very experimental. Uh, that heart has to has to do with it. Uh, it kind of rolled off the tongue. Experiment thirty four. And then everybody uh, wants it. Reminds me of something to do with Science Lab. <laughs> Absolutely. Like yeah. an Experiment thirty four. <laughs> but you don't you know, know what it is. The first thirty three didn't quite work. Yeah. Uh, when, we coming, <laughs> That's exactly when we were it. coming up with the name, but we hit it on the thirty fourth. So. Yeah. So now we're experimenting. Johnny for. actually drew the logo, and then we were just kind of set on it from there, just because it looks so cool. What, <laughs> is your, what is your logo? It's right it's there that. on the poster. Oh, it's just, it's yeah. just three yeah. with the four. With the four. You could uh, check us out on backwards? Facebook. It's on there. Uh, it's not backwards. It's just like kind of integrated into the back. I got three. you. I see it. Okay. Yeah. I see. yeah, I thought it was thirty-one when I saw that. <laughs> she told me it was thirty-four. I'm like, I don't see it thirty-four. Yeah. You can, like outline that. You see yeah. it now. Though. Yeah, I see it now, definitely. So, but, but like, what made you think of thirty-four? Like, you could have been an experiment four hundred well, twenty-seven or something. Thirty-four is my second favorite number. So. Uh, is, that, <laughs> second. is that your lucky number? Thirteen is my lucky number. Well, everybody's number, lucky number is thirteen. So. Yeah, actually. Yeah. But well, we uh, I like five personally. It's all of our second favorite number. <laughs> all our favorite numbers are different. Ricky Williams wore but thirty-four. We are, right? <laughs> but yeah, we have similar interests. So. Our favorite number adds up to thirty-four. Like, together. <laughs> all of your numbers it's, together. Well, that that works perfectly yeah, as well. well. That that mm -hmm. actually makes it, you know, experiment 34. Yep. Yep. And, and it's, it's a common fact that bands with number at the end are automatically, like, one of the best bands ever, so. Yeah, yeah because, like, <laughs> with your music and stuff, like, my favorite song was Mud, like I said. 
honestly. Um, we like that we'll be playing that one. For good, sure. I'm glad. It better be acoustic. acoustically. Yeah, okay, yes, good. Yes, yes, yes. Good. Um, do you want to tell me some stuff behind it? Like, what what's it about? Um, how long did it take for you to write it? Uh, well, Mud is one where we kind of came together and wrote that one. Uh, uh, we had Kevin was like, check this out. And I was like, check this out. And they kind of meshed together. It was perfect. Uh, Jack and, and Jake were able to put their fantastic spin on it as well. Um, and it came together as one cohesive, creative cohesive. track. He's acting like he uses big words. <laughs> <on the radio. laughs> well, that's how, that's how you know that there's something going on at the radio. Right. Yeah. 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 Uh, but it's about, uh, it's kind of about, Staring at the ceiling, not really what's coming, gonna happen next. Uh, you know, uh, there's there's good days, there's bad days. So you kind of kind of gotta roll with it. Um, you know, y what you'll get through it. What made you want to name it Mud though? Mud. Uh, well, there's a line in it. That's their favorite thing. Mud. <laughs> <laughs> we, we fling you mud at each other biking? for sport. <laughs> uh, no, it's uh, there's a line in it. Um, don't want to get stuck down there, stuck in the mud. Mm -hmm. um, and, and it just uh, sounds dirty. Yeah, it's, it's got a nice dirty, <laughs> it dirty riff dirty. to it. It's I was like, scared. I was like, these people are going to curse on the radio. Like, <laughs> I had to go to her so many times. Oh, we just started. So, <laughs> <laughs> so how long have you guys been together as a band? Pretty much exactly a year. Since birth? Yeah, um, <laughs> yeah we, we came out of the womb and we met, uh, you know, the, that the room where all the babies the are, are hanging out? Mm -hmm. we were, uh, I was like, hey, yo, we Matt, what's was going like, on? Let's do it. I was like, why is that guy banging on the, banging on the, on the bed, yeah. the little bed? I was a bed. <laughs> we were very intelligent <laughs> babies. It's yeah. so only a year. A year, yeah. That's amazing. Together, yeah. But it seems like it's been so much more. Because you guys really are has. all like a family. It feels like it's been a lot It does longer. feel like Like I can tell that you guys are like a family. You came in here like talking. Like, all, you were all talking at once. I was like, it's going to be a loud show. Because, like, it was so loud. I felt like it was going to echo throughout the whole building. So, yeah. Yeah. That's how we do. We like the, the music loud in this here band. But it's so. good with the chemistry <laughs> you guys have as well. as well. Like to work with it. Yeah. it that works. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Really? I, have, I, mean, I have no other friends other than have <laughs> They're actually yeah, not my friends. So. <laughs> like, I don't even know if they consider me friends. Yeah, it's sad, but it's true. No, it's definitely come out to some live shows. You'll see that chemistry in action. What was so. one of the songs that you guys wanted to uh, play? Play the uh, one song. We actually literally this is hot off the press. It's, it's not even done song, yet, actually. Right? Yeah, yeah, it's not mastered uh, or anything. Uh, it's still we still think it sounds pretty rocking. Um, we we recorded it once in the past. We think we really we hit the nail on the head with it. Here, it's called Three Days in the Chamber. Um, you know. Amanda, that was uh, something you wanted to say about. Right? Yeah, I love Three Days in the Chamber. It's an awesome song to like chill out to and just like relax. <laughs> you, I like your style. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She's so adorable. Sure. Oh my gosh. If that song chills you <laughs> out, yeah, then you, got, you some, got you got some darkness in you. <laughs> <laughs> she, she oh yeah, murder. <laughs> She sounds very sweet, but she's got a little, a little darkness oh, in no, her. Oh, no, she's adorable. Sure. You know Laura well. <laughs> Oh, no, darkness she is, is adorable. Good. Darkness is good. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it's kind of, you know, we'll, we'll kind of let it speak for itself. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, but it's, it's a bit of a mind trip, so, so Yeah, you guys say seats. hot off the presses because what have you been doing this August? We, we, we were in the were studio. just in the studio. Nice. Um, just recording got out of the studio. Yeah, music. Oh, can you believe, believe it or not? We <laughs> were not doing the audio books. Not the and playing Secret. basketball as well yeah, for, yeah, for a yeah. while, but uh, <laughs> we did uh, we did go in record a couple songs uh, mm -hmm. in Philly. Um, five, five songs. Uh, shout out to to Marston House mm -hmm. Studios, yeah. um, and we just got one back today. And we said, hey, we're going on this radio show. Not quite yeah, finished, finished, but it's it's. it's it's, it's okay. It's, it's okay. You yeah, can admit it. You did it just for us. Yeah. <laughs> you did, right? We, we, we did, though. We kept yeah, bothering them. We were like, we are going on this show. You have to. We yeah. want to impress us. <laughs> you want to have one. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, that's not even but it's okay. It's like an exclusive <laughs> DJ Danny show. So I really exclusive appreciate all. that. Yeah. Exclusive. Oh, wow. Thank you so much. This is wonderful for you guys, though, because like nobody's really heard this yet. So this is, nope. this is your person. debut. Oh, yeah. Not this version. No, no. Yeah, we've heard it for the first time today, basically. And what do you guys think of it? Before we play almost it, there. it sounds it's almost there. Yeah. Excited about it. So you guys have to uh, tweak like a little more. Oh, about oh yeah, stuff? definitely. Okay. Well, so we're gonna play. We it. need uh, more cowbell. <laughs> <laughs> Throughout. That's pretty much it, though. <laughs> and also less cowbell. <laughs> All right. So we've got three days in the chamber. Yep.
The picture changes. What does it mean? My mind erases. Not what it seems. Are they sleepless hazes? When I dream, fascinating faces. Jump Until I died, the key was small, the door was large, I stood and could not hide inside. The witch was not a friend, I know, someone very dark and pale. Whispers dream, what dream, what dream, what day's the time to jail? Say it's straight for what you've done, you say the answer, what could be? Live and die in the same time, and beg for what you say. If you ever speak, go right again, without a bread to chew and burn. Your box is all you'll ever need, your world will never turn. This is Laura Madsen, writer and celebrity publicist of theladyinredblog.com. For the latest takes on entertainment, music, food, fashion, and fun, come check me out at theladyinredblog.com. Hamilton Radio. Hamilton. Hamilton Radio. Hi, this is Mary Scholes, and you're listening to the DJ... Oh, let's do that again. Lolo. <laughs> Hi, this is Mary Scholes, and you're listening to the DJ Danny Show. So I want to know, who was doing the laughing on that track? That's Matt. <laughs> we yeah. too. Uh, yeah, I, 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 uh, yeah, I was going to say. Got the evil I laugh could. going on, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's actually insane, so it comes in pretty well. Oh, sorry. Right, I guess yeah, I'm I mean. You need to pull your cajon all the way up. Yeah, I know, yeah. And I need yeah, that man spread to play. Matt's yeah. really crazy. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's, it's scary. I, uh, I, I, you know, it's that's kind of a label. He has night terrors. <laughs> I have night happenstances. I call them. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, that does that sounds somewhat. Yeah, I don't know. Sometimes I, I don't know I'm what that walking means. around all of a sudden. I'm just. I, I was asleep. Now I'm not. <laughs> you're, you're insane, man. <laughs> so you sleepwalk outside at night sometimes? Sometimes. Sometimes he shows yeah. up at my house. Some people call it sleepwalking. Doesn't know what he's doing. Sleep driving. Sleep, sleep, sleep oh, flying. No. Uh, sleep jumping off of things. Yeah. So, Kevin, you were saying uh, that now this sounds a little bit different than the version that's been out on SoundCloud. And yeah. what, do you, what do you think about what you're hearing? It's, it's de it definitely sounds scarier. Sounds I think, I think yeah. so too. It works yeah. for Halloween. I'm serious. Exactly. When It'll you be, said that, I didn't know what song you meant. I didn't think, I don't know if Mud would qualify for that. <laughs> but I know that uh, Three Chambers or Three Days, three days, three days of chamber. chamber. Yeah, something like that. But yeah, um, that would qualify definitely for Halloween. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> definitely, yeah. We, we actually have a Halloween show um, at Championship Bar. 
Saturday. Yeah, that's a October thirty first. October thirty first on Halloween, and we'll be releasing it then. We'll be dressing up. You should come and dress up as well. You should throw candy. All of you out there. We're actually giving out candy. You are. What kind? Candy corn. Nobody's gonna like it, but we're doing it. Candy corn and cream corn. We can lace the candy. I love the cream corn. I'll be there for that. Yeah, I'm gonna have handfuls. We're just gonna throw it. We're not gonna play really. I'm gonna open up cans. It's not even a music show. We're just gonna be a food fight, most likely, on Halloween in your laboratory jackets. Absolutely. That's what we're experimenting with next. Just throwing food at our fans. That's experiment 35. We're gonna have to make another another direction. Food fight fans. Um. So who does the singing? In the band, which uh, that, that's me. You, uh, how long yeah. have you been singing? Been singing on and off for hmm, let's see, we've been a band for a year, so about two months. No, <laughs> 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 um, no I, I mean, the uh, the style of singing really I think is tailored um, uh, to the band. I've been I kind of more was experimenting with poetry, uh, creative writing. Um, you know, I led one thing to another, putting it to music, and uh, kind of learned from there, and. And it kind of worked. So that out. was your inspiration for stuff. your band? Is your poetry? Uh, well, for, for, for my singing? writing style, yeah, for my yeah. singing, yeah, that, that kind of, it started as one thing, uh, you know. And it ends up as another. Writing, way. creative writing, to poetry, mm -hmm. to song lyrics, to being able to. Acting. Write, uh, well, yeah, I was, uh, um, went to school for acting, and that uh, kind of is incorporated what did you in the show to? as well. Oh, Montclair State University. Nice. Yep. Ooh. <laughs> temple. I love acting. Yeah, I'll boo so it as when well. When I hear somebody <laughs> saying that they do acting, it's like, I want to hop on that because I want to know everything. I love acting. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's, a, acting, it's so. a fun profession. I find um, I, I have a lot more uh, with what we're, I've been focusing more on this, obviously, where we, yeah, we yeah. see each other all the time. We're practicing, you know perfecting our but art all the time. But everything you learn with your acting, you can use it as when you exactly, vocalize that's, with the band uh, and you, you get see the that. crowd pumped up. Yep. Exactly, well, the uh, that chemistry really on stage, for up. sure. Yeah. Which Absolutely. is totally good. I do the <laughs> background vocals. I try. Barely. <laughs> 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 and uh, how long have you been singing? Uh, probably, like, really singing. Yeah, like About really singing. Three years, I think. Okay, but well, that's good. Yeah. And uh, where's your inspiration come from? I like Jim Morrison and probably like Jimi Hendrix too. I love Jimi Hendrix. He has Bob Marley shirt on, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Which we, is totally different. When we met, we actually like we're, we bonded over Jim Morrison. That was something we had in common right off the bat. Yeah. Uh, Jim Morrison and Johnny Cash. Not, yeah, for sure. Yeah, you That's can kind of hear like a Doors influence, like yep. in your music. Oh, yeah. oh good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a huge compliment. Yeah. Thank you. That's great. And. <laughs> and we do have the rhythm section. Yes. yes. How long have I been singing for? Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do you do again? You do the guitar? I play bass. And, no bass. And I also do some backups. Okay. But well, I, then you sing somewhat. I literally just started yeah. singing probably like a couple months ago. Yeah. And where's your inspiration come from? Uh, probably <laughs> just. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I kind of draw it from them. I mean, I'm just like, I'll try to sound like these guys well, as my voice cracks. Um, and, uh, <laughs> And it's live. We're not editing that. Oh, okay, great. Perfect. <laughs> so How about it? Um, <laughs> no, I also like um, do some uh, chopper chante kind of high pitched vocals every now and then. But and, uh, but your true love is bass. You really? Oh yeah, yeah. absolutely. That's your thing. I can't play anything else, <laughs> <laughs> and I wouldn't want to. And you, Mister? Um, the drummer. Yeah, Jake. Yeah. It's all about the drums. Jack. Jack. I'm sorry. Jake, Jack, Jake, Jack. That's actually Johnny's was, nickname. Was there is Jake. A Jake in the yeah, name? that's Johnny, but he goes by Johnny now because he's weird and oh. changes his name. <laughs> okay. that he's actually on the run from the police. Earlier, yeah, I'm you guys not. just ratted okay. him out. He's been he's been committing murders all over as Jake. So yeah, so, Johnny, so yeah. So the police will be here <laughs> any minute. So yeah, thanks a lot, Jake. Jake go by Johnny. <laughs> it's more complicated. It's it's a very long story with the whole name. His real name is John. His family calls him Jake because there's too many Johns, and he's called Johnny because he just wants to be different than Jake and John. Exactly. All right. Cool. Okay. All right. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Johnny's just I a cooler swear stage I name. There was another person in the band named Jake, so I was totally confused. Well, he has another person inside too. It's I, ate, I, ate, I ate a small child named Jake like, a couple of years ago. 
Right. Man, so, he's only half digested. Yeah. Um, yeah, he still, he still talks every now and then. <laughs> it happens. That was the crack. We, the we've crack. dealt with it <laughs> very well. All right. So, drums. Like, you've just been doing it for years and years uh, and years. This, like is, this is the 10th year I've been playing drums. Oh, yeah. Um, so, you really found something you're comfortable with with the rest of these guys right now. Uh, you, you, <laughs> like, you like... Being with them. Well, yeah, I mean, it really is honestly the only thing I could have brought to them because I'm terrible at everything else. <laughs> um, oh, but, don't but, be that positive about it. But you know what? You know what? Yeah, I'm, I'm glad I'm with them. Uh, they're the best band I've ever been been, been a part Jack. of. Oh, uh, that is so and, um, making me blush. Even though I hate even <laughs> each and every one of them. Jeez, so. are turning red though. That's pretty hot, man. Yeah. <laughs> but you all seem to ha like have a similar style. It just kind of flows through you all. You have yeah, a really we, good. Yeah, we we. We it's like, like funky. Yeah, you know, we it's like funky blues. With everything. Fun. Yeah, we, we definitely mm -hmm. like the name says experiment mm -hmm. and all mm -hmm. genres kind of mixed together. We even got a little hip hop in there from some. We just songs. come yeah. together and jam. Right and now. then, like, every now and then, a song will come out. <laughs> yeah, and you know, the, the weird thing is, <laughs> I quit. So <laughs> <laughs> Live here on the radio, Jack quits. <laughs> <laughs> so, where did you guys all meet, though? Uh, Matt and I met on Match.com, actually. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The secret's out. Christian oh Mingle. Oh, my God. Christian. Uh, <laughs> Wait, I thought you and you were the one that was married. Uh, we, we got, we've all married each other yeah, on and off. It's been on yeah, and off. It's, it's, like a, a, it's on the download. Prison. Prison. Where's your divorce Stay. papers? You guys Stay. are all still together? We're all word of mouth. Legally. Legally. <laughs> <laughs> But we we uh, we did we did meet. Uh, we've actually we grew up around the corner from each other, but never really met Knew each other. Um, that is such a uh, Jersey is, band kind yep. of thing. Yeah, That's yeah. so cool. <laughs> we we, on, but we didn't know each other when we lived near each other. And uh, so did you just come out of your house and meet? <laughs> no, we met out. We did not Match.com, but there's a website called eHarmony. E <laughs> <laughs> Plenty of fish. Christian Mingle, no, Christian Mingle right? Uh, we, we noticed we were all on. We were both on all of those mm -hmm. match sites, so we were like, "This guy, I keep getting this guy as a match. <laughs> <laughs> I might as well meet him." We it met turns on. Out, we like music. So. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We met on uh, band, band mix. Actually, it's like wow. um, social media for musicians. Oh, I remember. Then uh, he messaged me. And I was like, it hey, was love at first uh, word. <laughs> word. <laughs> <laughs> he literally started playing something, and I was like, yeah, I got something to that, and made a like song. Like five minutes as we, we made. Yeah, literally. We made like 20 songs in a month. And then uh, we posted one of our songs online. And what was the first song you posted? Uh, it's called Deep Blue. We're actually going to be playing that one for you. Uh, that, that, that's that got a, quite a story behind it. Yeah. Um, we Black Hawk Love, Jared Kahn. Uh, shout out to him. Um, we recorded that when it was just me and Kevin at the time, and um, and it came out really well. We posted it on online, and Jake stumbled upon it. Johnny. Oh yeah, Johnny. I stumbled upon it. <laughs> I was Johnny. actually uh, I was in between bands at that time, um, and I just was you know shopping on Facebook, looking at local bands, and I saw the Strangers, and I played uh, Deep Blue, which is the only track they had on there. I fell in love instantly. It's the Doors, right? Right what, there. Is, what is it about exactly? I can't tell you what it's about. I don't know. <laughs> All I know is that uh, it was about just taking, rocking. Uh, responsibility for your own actions. Oh, Jake, basically. are you wearing my jeans? Uh, yes, I am. Okay. I was wondering where they went. But uh, <laughs> anyway. He's, he's my brother, by the way. <laughs> so I just commented on um, on that uh, his that track, like and I asked them if they needed a bassist, and he like, well, just almost instantly messaged me and was like, yeah, we do need a bassist, actually. As a matter and, uh, of fact. Yeah, as a matter of fact, we, we do. do. That's funny <laughs> how life you. works like that sometimes, yeah. you kind know? Yeah, stars align. Yeah, like, all good. exactly. Yeah. And yeah. then we had our first show in a week. Yep. So since you're talking <laughs> about It's True Blue, was it? Or was it Deep, Deep, Deep Blue? Deep, Deep Blue? Yeah. Since you're talking about why don't you play it? Oh, we, we're going to... Play yeah, it later. Track. Do you want to play that? We track? have the track. Yeah, we can do absolutely. It. We can okay. do it live. Sure. Yeah. This actually, this was about a year ago. We were, we were, um, we recorded this. Are you doing it live, or do you want to play the track? No, uh, we'll play the track for that one. Okay. Um. Yeah. It's it's Jared. Uh, Jared Blackhawk Love produced that, and uh, that was you know kind of the song that got us together. So it's, mm -hmm. it's got a got a cool story behind it. Well, we're gonna take a quick commercial break, and we're gonna play Deep Blue. And awesome. we'll be back to DJ Danny Show on HumptonRadio.net, stream HR2 with Experiment 34. Okay, you guys are clear. Let's see. Are you ready to go? Yeah, I'm ready to go. The night's young, honey, let's roll. Hey, man, 
and this is Spike from The Roasted Show with Chef John. Don't feel like cooking tonight, but would like a home-style meal? Want freshly prepared fruits, vegetables, meat, and fish? Then check out the Iron Skillet at Bordentown, New Jersey. A place to bring the family for breakfast, lunch, and dinner 24-7. Check out the Iron Skillet's daily fresh buffets. Come check out Chef John, nominated as one of New Jersey's top chefs by New Jersey's Best. So stop by the Iron Skillet for fresh food, friendly service, and a great family value. The Iron Skillet, 402 Rising Sun Road, Bordentown, New Jersey, 609-291-1145. That's the Iron Skillet, 402 Rising Sun Road, Bordentown, New Jersey, 609-291-1145. What are you doing tonight? This is Laura Madsen, writer and celebrity publicist of theladyinredblog.com. For the latest takes on entertainment, music, food, fashion, and fun, come check me out at theladyinredblog.com. And we're back to the DJ Danny Show on HumatoRadio.net, stream HR2 with Experiment 34. So, uh... What do you guys feel when you hear Deep Blue? What does it make you like think of? Do you want to read? Are you recording that one too in studio? Uh, well, we've uh, we 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 will be going in to re-record that one as a full band. It sounds a lot different. Um, now we it sounds we, uh, fuller. It mm -hmm. definitely sounds fuller. It sounds uh, you know we we like things loud. It's definitely got a little bit more grunge to <laughs> mm -hmm. it. Um, it's a little less laid back and swingy. But you know I like both versions. We can consider this one like a remix. 
Yeah. Pretty much. <laughs> yeah, yeah that's, that's pretty good. Now, you have a lot of shows coming up. What's your next show? Our next show is uh, September 4th at Roxy and Dukes. Uh, it's a great little place in, uh, in Dunellen. Really, awesome. um, really, really cool vibe there. It's like you go in and you're just immediately in a circus. Yeah, it's, it's nuts. It's a side show. A lot show. of crazy stuff. Exactly, exactly. That's, like that's, that's not very cool. vibes. That's crazy circus vibes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> definitely. We should, uh, I, could, I would make that place my home if I could. <laughs> <laughs> we, uh, we also have a show coming up uh, September 12th at the Brighton Bar in uh, Long Branch. Um, and the 27th at Crossroad, Crossroads. Uh, it's in Garwood. Mm -hmm. That's then, a lot of stuff. Oh, oh, and we're opening Restival on Sunday, um, October 4th. Wow. Dead nice. Dead nice. Dead you guys first. are being booked everywhere left yeah. and right. Yeah. We're, we're, yeah. <laughs> we're keeping busy. Uh, summer's ending, and we're keeping busy. Yeah, um, we're just taking any show we can get. <laughs> <laughs> you, can, uh, you can check out anything we're doing uh, coming up on Facebook, uh, facebook.com slash experiment34. And, uh, yeah, go, go check it out. Give us a like. You can so follow us on So if everyone wants that. to find out more about where you are playing, where can they go? Yeah, well, you could go uh, to, we got Instagram, Facebook. Yeah, head out, check out. What's your Experiment website? 34. There's a lot of good stuff on there. Uh, Experiment34, spelled, spelled out, uh, yeah. dot com. Yeah, Experiment34. Wait, we have a website? <laughs> <laughs> Saying, like, I don't know that. Oh, my goodness. You didn't know you guys had a website? Well, I mean... He yeah, no. Or did you forget about you? You never knew? Nope. Well, no, no, he, he just, just plays found drums. out. Oh, yeah, he just plays literally. Like I said, we say, go in the corner, <laughs> pick up your sticks, and have fun. <laughs> <laughs> so yes. how do you guys come up with, like, your outfits for your shows and stuff? Uh, we're usually... I roll out of bed uh, yeah. and just hope that it works. Yep. <laughs> um, so maybe, uh, bed head, comb, most likely. Comb my hair a little bit. I actually but, change my skin, too. Yeah, so it's not skin. just a clothes thing, you know what I mean? It's got to be the whole package. Jack's half reptile. Yeah. <laughs> Sheds. Sheds like, yeah, week. shedding is the right word. It's like molt. It's yeah. like molting type. No, but you guys, like, you've, you've definitely, you know, changed your style even over the past year. I've been, I've been kind of, like, cyber-stalking you. Yeah. <laughs> you know, so, like, yeah, you have changed, you know, like... Some of you guys are growing a little facial hair now. Oh, the well, hair's yeah. changed a bit, you know. Yeah, like we all just went through. We're all just yeah, so puberty jealous of Kevin. Puberty at 22. Crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm actually going for a world record for the longest time, not ever shaving again. Ah, I see. Not ever <laughs> shaving, shaving again. again. It's yeah. been a year and a half. <laughs> but even now, you're all coordinated. You know, you've got like the blacks and the grays, and you know, going on and stuff like that. Very expressive. We, uh, yeah, we that was actually, totally on purpose. We were, <laughs> we were created in a laboratory, and mm. they just kind of tell us what to wear. Like, <laughs> the people, what, like the Powerpuff the Girls? Charge. Exactly, yeah. like the, better than the Powerpuff Girls. But Mojo yeah. Jojo is not allowed. We're, we're yeah. working on our on our TV show theme song right now. Mm -hmm. so. Our next Test round. two babies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, um, what you were saying about like your beard and everything, yeah. are you trying to be like Dumbledore? Like you want it? I'm just that trying long? to be Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> but, but eventually, it isn't that long. I mean, I, I trim it, which I shouldn't. That's actually a sin. <laughs> because he's Jesus. So but sins I've, aren't allowed. I've broken about three pairs of scissors on my beard because it's just so thick. <laughs> that is a lie. That's <laughs> <laughs> not a lie. <laughs> Length and thickness are different things, Kevin. <laughs> well, I I'm never shaving again. <laughs> Mark my word. <laughs> you heard it here. You heard it here, folks. Yeah. <laughs> you heard it here first. <laughs> Did you guys want to perform an acoustic song? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we'll yeah for sure. It. Are uh, you going to play Mud? Yeah, we'll yes. play Mud. I love Mud. Okay. Definitely. The song, is, the song is called Mud. Hey, Nick. <laughs> yeah, we're not doing that part. <laughs> we, like, we like to do impressions. We can do that so we'll part. do a few for you afterwards. <laughs> I 
stuck down there Coming up for air, air I'm coming up for air Don't wanna get stuck Don't wanna get stuck down there Incredible, that was great. Oh my gosh, Thank that was you. amazing. I love the guitar playing. <laughs> Thank you. Ah. <clears throat> I just that started. was <laughs> He just started. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Seriously. Exactly. If you want like... to uh, contact us, you can hit us up on our email, experiment34. Do you guys have a booking manager or your own manager mostly? Just we kind of been doing it on our own. Yeah, yeah. we do it on our own, but you're gonna need a booking manager help? real soon. Hit us up. What's your dream gig to play? Wembley. Yep. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's immediately what comes to mind. Like, and, and who would open for you? Uh, us. No, it's, it's just going to be us. We We're going to play for sex. four hours straight. <laughs> yeah, no, okay. Well, my next question was, how long is your set normally, like when you play? Well, usually... Uh, what the venue gives us. Yeah, the yeah. What's your longest... Been, uh, I think like five to an hour. Yeah, we played point. three hours before. Oh, that, was, yeah. that was actually oh, yeah, because we, we had to play yeah. a lot of covers. So we got together about uh, 25, almost 30 songs and... That still cents. wasn't even that much time, <laughs> so we just dragged out songs for forever. We played What I Got by Sublime for 15 minutes straight. <laughs> yep, <laughs> not even kidding. Um, another question I was going to say is, uh, who would you guys want to be, you know, like, your label? Like, who would you want to be under? <laughs> who would you want to be signed by, most sign likely? <laughs> well, is there a specific um, label that you guys would like to be signed really by? I really look into that. really big yeah. Justin Bieber fan. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Clearly, Whoever did One Direction, Simon Cowell, I guess. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was X Factor, most likely. What? Simon Cowell. <laughs> yeah, I know, but he produced One Direction. He got them together. Yeah. They all really auditioned good. as separate guys, and then he was like, okay, you guys all go together. And by taking yeah. hiatus. Yep, right. And they're actually breaking up. So. Oh, good, good. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Music what? is safe. Are you serious? <laughs> My dreams are dashed. Where's, where's the cake? For for that for that band oh, breakup, no. we need to don't say cake because if my sister's listening, she will literally like be mad because cake. Well, she's sick right now. Oh. But every time she heard cake, she would want cake. What's like, wrong with stop. cake? It's like, a great band. Also, the though. cake is a lie. Cake <laughs> is cake is good. What about like, yeah. 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 No, ice cream cake? cake crunches with out. those cake. Oh my goodness oh. gracious! So what? What's cake. your cake? What's your new album word. called? And when is it coming out? Our new album. We've been throwing is, around. Uh, um, yeah, we've been throwing around a couple ideas, but we're gonna. We'll we'll say uh, we'll uh, we'll surprise you. I think because we haven't gotten all the songs back yet, but we've been throwing around. We some don't ideas. know. <laughs> 
front runner probably for now would be uh, Pawns to a King. That's, uh, that's what we're leaning towards, but that's one of the, the lyrics in, in one of our favorite, more uh, harder songs that we play yeah, that called up. Cylinders, so um, be on the alert for that song. Nice. Uh, and then when you hear it, you're like, oh, When's the release for that song? Or you no. don't know? We don't know. We didn't, we just got back three days in the chamber, so we don't we don't know. Uh, right. we didn't so it's get probably going to be twenty sixteen. You think twenty? Uh, <laughs> maybe early. Maybe it'll, it'll, be, it'll be a Christmas present. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe hey, that would that would be really we cool. We should do a Christmas cover of like a song or something for Christmas. Because you have yeah. a Halloween song. Why don't you do Christmas too? Yeah, I mean, are you going to do something I've for Turkey Day? Many, for sure. For yeah. like, can we do Afro Man? Forty-five. David has all we need. Yeah, exactly. Great song. So you've got some new tracks on it too, right? Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. absolutely. All right, so so what are they called? Give us some teasers. All right, well we we went in, recorded some tracks. We have cylinders as a, as a, you heard, three days in the chamber. Mm -hmm. uh, what else we got, guys? Come along, right. purple Come wine, along. purple it's... wine, and uh, hungry. hungry. Mm -hmm. I heard purple. That's my favorite color. What's that about? <laughs> purple wine. Purple wine is, is about like um, wine? the color purple. So you're in luck. <laughs> uh, <laughs> huge <laughs> Barney the dinosaur. It's fan. about Oprah <laughs> peeing in a field. Jesus turns water into wine or something. That's exactly what we got going. No, it's, uh, <laughs> She's it's wearing a little purple bit though. Different. So she must have knew the song was coming up. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you can you can How say you, know? you wrote it for me, even though I'm known as the lady in red. Actually, purple's my favorite color too. I know, right? Yeah. That's what I said. I kind of I'm ironic. <laughs> 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 but um, honestly, yeah. I mean, yeah. that sounds like a great song. <laughs> well, all your songs well, are great. As opposed to like green wine or something. Yeah, that, yeah, that, that would be. Yeah, don't drink that one. <laughs> <laughs> that might be rancid. That is slime well, wine. <laughs> They're a good band too. <laughs> <laughs> um, do you guys have any interesting stories you would like to tell? Like uh, maybe tell about about how purple wine got its name. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a good one. Oh yeah, that's good. That one. Uh, I don't even think this. The song's not about purple wine at all. But I got okay. the name. I wrote the, the song the day after uh, my friend uh, told me a story about how he was working at Applebee's, mm -hmm. and uh, this couple came in, and they just sat down and said, hey, you got that purple wine? And he was like, <laughs> he was so thrown off by that, he was like, we, I don't even think that exists. Yeah. Like, there's, 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 there's blush wine, we have white wine, there's red wine, they I've met, never right? heard of purple they wine. Met, right? <laughs> just very uneducated people. Yeah. It, was a, it was a whole ordeal for him, and then... Uh, I just had this riff stuck in my head the next day at work, and I ran home to record it, and I was like, gotta have a name. I'll just call it Purple Wine. It was the first thing I thought of. Because <laughs> your friend said it from Apple. Yeah. Mm. Most of the song names the don't have anything, anything to do to with do. the song. Yeah. That's it's normally just how it works. Yeah. Yeah. Unless, well, magic. Mud actually <laughs> says Mud in the song. Yeah, I mean, so that are... works for that, but... Those, but yeah. those are the theme yeah, of the song. Yeah. Theme of it. Yeah. <laughs> what is the theme of your album? Madness. Edge. Yeah. Edge. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Madness. Uh, what would you say your genre of music is most likely? Experimental. 34. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so madness. I should have thought that coming here, actually. No, All right, that's three times though. we used that joke. The law is no more. <laughs> I actually, I hear some funk in your songs, too. Oh, yeah. yeah so, yeah, like, sure. I hear a lot mm -hmm. of funk, most yeah. likely. We, yeah. we all bring our, our influences. Uh, I'm mainly influenced by Flea and any kind of uh, funky slap bassist. That's like, I love that. And, and, uh, dude. All big chili peppers. Uh, I'm, I'm influenced by uh, Jimi Hendrix, uh, Jerry Cantrell. Uh... That's from Alice in Chains. Yeah. So. Zach Wild, dude. <laughs> yeah, Zach Wild too. Yeah. You pinch. And uh, you got them pinches. Frank and Dweezil Zappa. That <laughs> Alm, uh, Greg Allman. Dwe did Dwe you Alman. say Salt and Pepper? No. Wait, what did you say? He pushes Frank, it really Frank good. Frank and Dweezil yeah. Zappa. Oh, okay. See, Zappa sound like Pepper. <laughs> 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 I remember that happened. Yeah. Okay. That makes a lot more it's sense. A big Kevin pushes yeah. it. You just really put good. it in a blender and then I drink it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> so Johnny, like you said that you just you know got something in your head and, and you started writing a song. Does that happen in like all of you guys or, yep. or there's pretty much so like any sure. of you can just like you Come know, up hey with guess what I came up with this new song these new That's, lyrics this new whatever. It's usually just the part run and then it. we just keep yep. adding yeah. to it. Can you do that? Just... Can you do that now? No. Right now. <laughs> well, uh, we don't. If we had our instruments, we probably could. <laughs> yeah, 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 if we were all plugged in. And stuff, it's just. Yeah. Um, hmm. Usually one Teaser of us will come up with like a riff or a jack will come up with a drum beat or something and we're, we just come to practice and uh, hey, I wrote this riff 
and we focus on it. Yeah, me and me and Kevin will jam it for like twenty minutes straight, just the one riff yep. without building off of it at all. Sorry, I was just destroyed this whole setup. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and Jack always comes in with something that's killer, and it's just. We have faith in one another that we're all going to do our jobs. Speak right? for yourself. I, oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right. But you know what? That's yeah. good. And if you all have positive energy, it, then exactly. it all works. Yeah. I don't you, write so. the I don't write the guitar parts for him. I don't write drum parts for him. I don't even write lyrics yeah. because that's not my job. I'm the bassist. Mm. Yes, yeah, so you know. just write chords. And in a lot of bands, bass you'll, you'll find the one guy who's kind of like, no, it goes like this and this. Yeah. And, uh, we we don't do that. We no. yeah. Yeah. Right. You all yeah. like just come together. Yeah. Like someone takes charge of the direction or something. That's we all do what we do. That's why. This like is my favorite well. band. Yeah, yeah this exactly. is, uh, that's, that's what it is. It's what a band's supposed to be. Yeah, for a sure. Collection of, of creativity. That's the relationship you guys have, you know, with each other. A lot of we sexual don't, tension. We don't yeah. limit each other. <laughs> <laughs> that's actually what all the songs are. Yeah, yeah, it's it's just, just, just the whole yeah. time we're just staring at each other intently, just like playing the song. <laughs> you know what we're Ooh, doing. I like the way you hit that tongue. <laughs> <laughs> Slap that bass. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> This is such a fun show, though, seriously. <laughs> I don't think I ever thought it was going to come to this, but I think it's amazing now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. It's great. So do we have another track that we're going to be doing live? Uh, yeah, we can play another yeah, song for you. Uh, for sure. I really, like like, I really like how you guys sound live. It's, Thank you. It's, Good. it's amazing. Definitely. We, well, we do have some shows coming up. Yeah, so well, all you, you out there, there. and you, <laughs> yeah. you guys as well, come and come yeah, check the it next out. One's more September dynamic, 4th, right? September 4th, Roxy yeah. and Dukes. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Um, we'll play Get Off. It's okay. One of our yeah. songs. Okay. It's more that funk that you were talking about before. <laughs> Definitely. Oh, yeah. Hey, that's, that's the best song, honestly. <laughs> Bring that funk. All right. Bye, I'll boy. Just aim this at my crotch real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I can write a love song just to get you all on my back. I can write a love song, turn you on. If I can write a love song just to jump you off your track, I can write a love song, get you all. I'm feeling just in, and it's your mold. Your position What did you prove? What did you prove? Come on What did you prove? Play that guitar Again, gin and tea. <laughs> Remember, no it's toothbrush. The go to. Yeah, no toothbrush at all. Nope. Sure. Um, Oysters for aphrodisiacs. Do you guys drink coffee? You seem like you drink a lot of you Oh, know, yeah. Like, uh, oh, well, why? Just, why? Because we're wired as crap? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We call it go juice. At one of our last band rehearsals, uh, Matt was so kind to bring us uh, chocolate 
bars, Ooh. and they were just filled with caffeine. 50 Half a cup in each bar. And yeah. Um, we we I had about five, and then he had five in an hour. Right yeah. And, then <laughs> and we were crazy. crazy. I had a couple of those with some coffee, and I have I have pretty bad anxiety disorders. So I just threw up for the rest of the night. Yeah. It was terrible. <laughs> so Jack, Jack read on the label. He's like, "Do not exceed four. Oh, five. Okay. So oh, good. I had five. Perfect. <laughs> Wait, what kind of uh, chocolate bars were they? Uh, they had an owl they were like on the cover. Wake, I don't know. Wake, awake, like, awake, awake. He, he got them at yeah. Staples. Staples. <laughs> I was like caffeinated. I looked at the back. I was like, have a cup of. All right. Mean, caffeine is. And a uh, it worked. <laughs> it, it did the trick. So nobody needs shots. You could just have the. You could just have the. You know the chocolate. The chocolate. Yeah. Oh no no, vodka shots are cool too. Oh, no, I mean, yeah. the oh. shots like the shots you drink to keep yourself awake. Oh, like the oh, oh you know, like the energy, energies, the energy yeah. things. Oh yeah, like four of those a day minimum. Minimum. <laughs> <laughs> Why not five? He did five. He could do five. Well, because then. Well, he not... didn't sleep. That would be. <laughs> yeah, I didn't sleep for a while after Forever. that, and that would be twenty-five hours. Yeah, yeah that's crazy. And that would be. Just like, that would be uh, crazy. Yeah. Yeah. More than a whole day. No band practice that day, right? Or maybe just too many. Twelve band practices. Extra band. Practice. I'm actually no not allowed to have coffee past um, 5 p.m., but I had some today. Just <laughs> I'm actually out past my curfew right now. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> so Anything we'll... embarrassing ever happen at one of your shows? Uh, I want to hear the juicy well, stuff. The, uh, Other bands? Yes. The, uh, <laughs> no, the, you uh, guys. One time the mic cable came off the mic. <laughs> that so, happens oh, like in every show. Yeah. Yeah. We go, we go oh, too boy. hard on the mics. But, uh, we, we were no crazed away. fans, nothing really. <laughs> uh, that, that comes oh, after you know the what? show. There was um, this one guy at uh, oh, one of God. our shows. He yeah. was oh, my gosh. in this He's full great, cowboy getup. He, he had like this rope or something that, right? that he Wait, was, was I there for with? this? I don't know. If and a cowboy there. hat. I just but, remember the um, left shark dancing around all over the place for the Brighton show. <laughs> oh, remember yeah. from like the like that Breakfast Kid band or whatever it was. Yeah, it's just yeah. funny. But um, <laughs> this guy, this, he, he was in the hat. full full he cowboy got on stage, just oh. dancing around with this rope, and <laughs> and he was like the only one doing it, and it was just like going hard. Our biggest fan, he was standing yeah. like right up front, just going nuts with this rope, just like. <laughs> I got off stage. Uh, he, with he had to be like he had to be like almost uh, in his forties, like but he was like he was he was getting down. He was laughing. Oh, yeah. 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 Was he laughing? Oh yeah, he was laughing. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Around his neck, he was like. Yeah. Would you say that that's oh, yeah, representative that awesome. of your fan base? <laughs> no doubt. Some about of our newer yeah. songs are a little <laughs> southerner, yeah. For, for the most part. Uh, we, Southern and eccentric, yeah. yeah uh, exactly. We prefer that our fans and wear music. full cowboy get up. Full cowboy get up. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so. And dance with ropes. Definitely go out, get yourself some cowboy gear. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Couple and ropes, you know, you never know if you're going to need Just two ropes. Just laugh a while, right? Yeah. Horses yeah, are because you'll, you'll, you'll never know forever. if you wind up being a story on a future radio <laughs> show. <laughs> <laughs> What was on this radio show? Just last week? <laughs> um, so you can't see it, but it looks really good. <laughs> well, we don't have cameras. It's yeah. only yeah. talking. That we know of. <laughs> but uh, what is the lifelong dream you guys have as a band together? Uh, to break up. No. <laughs> to break up. We want to have a really a sad year. story and then make a Hollywood movie about us. No. Well, if I, don't, if I don't murder them all in the next year or so, then hopefully we can we can just get discovered and. No, we, we are actually. Uh, we do have an announcement. Um, that, so one of our dreams we're we're going to be pursuing um, in the summer we're going to be moving to Nashville actually. Yep. Yes. Uh, you better come back to Jersey going. afterwards. Oh, yeah, we'll be back. No, no place like No home. promises. <laughs> what is this, Dorothy? Um, but, yeah, oh, my gosh, I'm really proud of you guys. Yeah, um, we're, we're really pretty excited. excited for that. Do you have a studio that you're going to go up there and everything, like, you know, picked out or the place you're going to live at and stuff, or you're just going to go there? We're actually, we're just going to, like, wander the streets. and, yeah. <laughs> yeah. and We were going to hope someone had their like, phone out yeah. and was recording us. Yeah. They <laughs> might, we'll sleep in someone's car for a little bit. We'll just keep opening cars till we find the mm -hmm. one that's open. We'll make that a home. Do you think it's going to be a roommate situation? Like, should we, like, expect... Oh, we're going to get a house together. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. we're talking reality series, probably. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Every, every yeah. Why don't you guys get MTV houses. on this? This is going to be, like, rich. <laughs> it's going to be amazing. <laughs> We'll, we'll call them. We'll give them a call. B we'll have our people call them. MTV people. Cribs, but we it's are like our really people, bad. Yeah. Yeah. Just like ghetto and just yeah, like we not. We just live in a crack house. house. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you're like doing stuff, but then you wouldn't know what you're exactly doing. Or it might turn out sexual, but not really. Well, yeah. yeah I mean, it's <laughs> the first MTV Cribs That's where cool. we actually sleep in actual cribs. Yeah. <laughs> Well, that's where we met, in the, in the <laughs> hospital, so. Yeah. <laughs> so then, where do you guys see yourself in a few years? In a few in, years? 
Nashville. In a few years, Hopefully. I, I kind of yeah. let the the wind. We'll let the wind take us, and maybe in Nashville. five years, maybe London. a new country that doesn't yeah. exist. Yet. You guys want to tour? You want to tour in London? I, I want. I want. To, I want to get big enough to where it's not far fetched to say we can go to London. You know what I mean? Let's go to yeah. London. You sound mm -hmm. like you're from London. <laughs> like that? that wasn't what was that at? That wasn't yeah, close that was, to it was an attempt. You idiot. <laughs> yeah, it, was, it wasn't even close. It's called an attempt. <laughs> so you're ready for a life on the road if that's where it takes you. Yeah, Absolutely. yeah exactly. Yeah, wherever wherever it takes us in a few years. We'll We're be. not good at anything else. So. <laughs> <laughs> Music so has made its out. calling, and this is what. Uh, this is definitely what I'm going to be doing. We all find life. happiness doing it. So, we so if anybody wants show. to donate a tour bus to your cause, where can they find you again? They can find us on Facebook. At ex experiment, experiment 34. 34. Uh, you can find us on our website, experiment34.com. Uh, but it's also, all spelled out. We're probably yeah, are, are going to be starting that, like GoFundMe or yeah, Kickstarter. Yeah, we're going to be starting that. No, do that. Indigo. GoFundMe Indigo. does not work. Indigo, Indigo, Indigo works. Indigo. All the time. Yeah, yeah. I keep. Good that's enough. the only one I donate to. Actually, I'm not even being. I'm just being <laughs> serious. Because GoFundMe, I don't think actually works that well. Mm, like Kickstarter. Indigo, but you must have a couple of perks in order to get some. People. Oh well, yeah. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, we'll show that's up at works. your house naked and Sexual sing a birthday flavor. song. It's okay. You know, My whatever. favorite metal band who has a page right now, they're gonna do cookies if you donate 35. So I'm like. I cookies. Like it. It's the only time prostitution is legal. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you're not really paying for it; you're donating it. Yeah. You're like, thanks. Here's some stuff. Yeah. Here's some stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, Limited edition, five parts. five times. Yeah. <laughs> Limited edition only. That's the thousand dollar package. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious! This is such a fun show. <laughs> <laughs> And how can they get tickets to your September 4th game? Uh, yeah, you can message us, uh, show up at the door, but if you, if you want tickets ahead of time, reserving your spot, uh, yeah. definitely check us out on Facebook, and we're very responsive. How Facebook much are the tickets? Facebook even tells us how responsive we are. We're pretty proud of that. <coughs> tickets are usually... Uh, 10 to 12. Tickets are 10. Tickets are 10. Yeah. Yeah. At awesome. the door, they're 12, though, so I mean, you could save you that get, extra like, two, two bucks. Yeah, mm -hmm. right. <laughs> get it from us, we deliver. Yeah. You although, know, we, we although just... I don't think we have a pre sale for this fourth show. I think it's just at the door. Oh, it's yeah, just at the door. Yeah, for Roxy and Dukes. To Roxy and Dukes. The other ones, there's tickets, but the other, just come on by to Roxy and Dukes mm -hmm. and, uh, and check it out. You guys do any meet and greets? Uh, yeah, yeah, anybody, we're, anybody. we watch it. We're always in the crowd watching every band beforehand, so I mean, if you find us, just come say hello. We don't bite. Well. well. Hard. Yeah, we, we don't bite. We bite a little bit. We don't bite but, hard. Some licking. <laughs> we don't bite hard. We won't oh, wait, draw blood. Yeah, we don't bite. We taste. Oh well, that was him. I'm not that yeah, insane. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, you mentioned that your about. bracelet tastes terrible. I was just so trying to tie to my, my string mine, bracelet and mine back up. tastes really good. And you know, it's not like I washed my bracelet, so it tasted like sweat. That's all I'm saying. I don't have. Well, I guess I have better tasting sweat. And what did yours say yours tasted like? Grapes. Uh, oh, grapes. grapes. Sweaty grapes, yeah. for sure. Yeah, it was huh. delicious it, and odd at the same time. Uh, the question is, how do you know what sweaty grapes taste like? He's had them before. <laughs> right. yeah, yeah, answer. That's, that's the pre-show, along with gin and well, tea. That's the <laughs> you know how you know how the, the Napoleon sweaty Dynamite grapes. had tater tots in his pockets, right? I mean, Matt goes around with grapes, with grapes instead. Sweaty grapes. <laughs> they, get a little, you know, they get a little moist, and you know what? It's car it adds character it, to it. It's salty it. They taste and good. odd. And, yeah. uh, it's everything you need. bit vinegary. Perfect. Salt. It, it just happens. Oh, vinegar. It's salty. Yeah. That sounds like a pickle, most likely now. <laughs> so they're <laughs> pickled grapes. Pickled yeah. grapes. Yeah, that sounds. Yeah. You never heard of that? Pickled sweaty grapes, most likely. Pickled yeah. sweaty grapes. Yeah. Yeah. We, we actually That's sell the name of our next album. Our shows <laughs> at our sweaty merch grapes. table. That's gonna be the name of your next song. Yeah, right. Yeah. Sweaty, sweaty grapes. grapes. Sweaty pickled grapes. Yeah. Grape sweaty. Sweaty pickled grapes. <laughs> Grape that picks. Could, that could be a good kid song though. Grape sweaty sweaty. What do you think, Manda? You think it works? Yeah. We'll have you guess on it, and you can, you can sing, like, yeah, the echoes yeah, for us. Anybody know the hook yet? Yeah, it's just like, pickled sweaty grapes, and she'll go, pickled sweaty grapes, and then we'll just do it again, but just for, like, five minutes straight. Yeah. That's it. I mean, that's the whole song. That's exactly what a kid song is. Yeah. It's the addicting part that you can't get out of your head. That's another song in the bank. Next yeah. song. That was easy. <laughs> Gold star for Jack. Yeah. <laughs> Ringo wrote a song. Oh, yeah. that, that's something we do. Jack. Whenever one of us. On their uh, yeah, right here where everyone. So, can see what us. are your upcoming shows? One more time. One more. Okay. Uh, yeah, Just we so have, we can uh, plug, you know, before the show ends, I want to get all your information out there. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, um, we put all this on Facebook. Uh, it's facebookcom slash experiment 34 We have Roxy and Dukes uh, September 4th, Brighton Bar uh, September 12th, 
Um, September 27th, we'll be at Crossroads. Uh, October 4th, we'll be opening Rustival. We're very excited about that. Um, and then we have a Halloween show at Championship Bar right around the corner. Plus so more Trenton. that we just don't know about right now because it's now. Right? Maybe it'll come to you <laughs> right off of my show, though. Maybe. Yeah, People will awesome. contact you, you should, right uh, off of the show. The phones show. will be off the hook. Yeah. Uh, but if we have more coming up, again, check it out. And on, next year, uh, Nashville. Facebook. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, next year, yeah. Nashville. Wait, come take so a trip. So you're going to move in right when it's 216 or um, 2016? We're, gonna, or? we're shooting towards uh, June. summer for when we're going to be uh, making uh, the move. But, uh, a little less than a year from now, yeah. Yep. You guys right. are counting down. You know, you're yep. like all prepared Saving for it. Getting, uh -huh. uh, getting ourselves ready. Yep. We have our own little piggy banks, and we're just. Yeah. <laughs> I already have a whole saving twelve up our bucks. Pennies. Perfect. <laughs> I have like seventy six cents saved. I like, yeah, that's why I thought I got a whole twelve dollars. I had like three million. <laughs> three million dollars. <laughs> Yeah, but that's, that's just for him. Wait, but half of it's been wasted off of your scissors for your beard, hasn't yeah. it? Well, yeah, he's bought a lot of beards. Yeah, that's, <laughs> yeah. yeah. that's true. And so also, not three million anymore. Is yeah. it? Probably like. 200, actually. <laughs> 200 <laughs> pairs of scissors. Right. Now that I think of it. It's oh been, his beard's been an investment, let's just say that. Yeah. It's I have a, a savings account for it, so. actually. I own stocks in it. In Kevin's beard. If Everybody you shave does. it, I lose everything. <laughs> That's why I'm never shaving, Jack. Well, thank you. You're okay. saving my investments. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah. No well, you guys have the look. You have the sound. Wish you the best. I, I think uh, you got thank something you. here that's going to really take much. off. Appreciate it. Really Thanks nice for having us on. Do you have anything else you wanted to add before the show ends? Um, we have one more song, right? Yeah, we do. We have, yeah, we have time for one more? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, we have one do more it. song. Sure. Wait, which one is it? <laughs> sweaty grapes. Yeah, this is, oh, yeah. wait. No, salty, salty, pickled sweaty grapes. Salty oh, grapes. Pickled. What was that? Come along? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, this one's called Come Along. This will be on our uh, upcoming album, so. Nice. So definitely check it out. Be on, the, uh, be on the alert for this one, too. Do, um, are you doing the, the rhythm? <laughs> yep. Okay. He's going to play the bass the song. Crotch. <laughs> <laughs> we need crotch mics in here. Why <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys aren't crotch mics? Uh, she was drinking something. I was. She almost destroyed. I almost like <laughs> choked. <joke. laughs> Wouldn't have been my fault. <laughs>
This album has so much variety, and I, I really <laughs> we're so psyched for, for it, though. I really <laughs> like it because so many times, you know, you can listen to an album and like every song has something that just sounds similar to the other mm -hmm. one on it. Thank you. Really it's very experimental. It's like it's all different. Thing. <laughs> no, but it, it's you broke the law. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? That's the fourth time he used the law. Yeah. He broke the law. You're you're out. You're you're just Kevin. You're out of the band. What are you gonna do? What? <laughs> You're out of the band, Kevin. You can leave now. He thinks because he's got an associate's degree, he's better than all of us. So. Yeah. It's, it's I went to school longer, Kevin, okay? <laughs> exactly. I didn't get a degree. <laughs> that doesn't make you sound bad. Either. Thank you guys so? so much for being on my show. I Thank really appreciate it. I had so us, much fun. Yeah. I wish you good luck with everything and, like, you know, really good luck, especially when you move into Nashville yeah, and we're everything. Excited. Yeah. Because, like, Appreciate it's it. going to be like amazing up there probably and the best what you can get yeah. and studio wise and people like reach out to and all that fun lovely really cool stuff yeah thank Absolutely. you for having us, for having us on. Thank and thank you Laura and Amanda for you know co-hosting as well i thank really you. appreciate it oh yeah thanks for having me back no and, uh, problem you guys can uh, catch more of a lot of stuff going on and a copy of this broadcast at the ladyinredblog.com in a couple of days if uh, you didn't if you tuned in late and uh, it's going to be on youtube yeah. Woo! Yeah. All right. YouTube in. Thank you so much, everyone. Uh, tune in next week for Bros and Mo's. Good night, everybody. Cool.